like you said. Um, you know, team, teamwork is, is the main the main key. You know, you can't go out there and do it by yourself. It takes um, everybody on the team. So one through 15, 17 here with the two-way players um, uh, that come together and win. You know, uh, you can't do it yourself. It's a team sport. Uh, one player working for one another. Um, that's the only way you can win. Seemed like you were happy to be home. You, you get a good game today. I mean, did it feel good being back at the ACC? Um, yeah, definitely. You know, uh, you know, get a little, a little back, back comfortable um, being in your home, uh, home city, uh, home fans, um, home court. Um, feel a little uh, relaxed and uh, get a little adjusted to the game. What's the difference between how you guys played in the second quarter and the third quarter? Like, what are you guys doing differently to have a quarter like that? Um, we came in and talked about what we needed to do. You know, just minor things that uh, we weren't communicating um, in the second unit's uh, first stint in the first half, and uh, we really tightened up and focused in on those things, and um, we were able to get stops. And uh, uh, when you know you're taking the ball at the basket, it's hard to you know get your offense going, but um, we we're able to get stops and get out in transition and uh, get easy buckets. Norm, how, do you, how much do you think the last couple of weeks have the, the second unit have taken a little bit of a dip? How much does that play into other teams gunning for the second unit that much more? They're getting geared up for the second unit. I mean, I mean it's, it's the league. It's tough. You know, um, you come out, you come out juiced uh, first couple games, a lot of energy, you know, a lot of effort, a lot of hustle plays. Um, you know, we're still a young second unit, you know, learning to play through, you know, the high minutes that guys are playing. Um, you know, but uh, it's just about focusing in. You know, it's nothing that um, the other team is doing that we're not used to or we haven't seen. It's just us um, locking in and being laser-like focused from the moment we come into the game and check in like we were doing early on in the season. Did you think it's on in this first game back? Um, I thought he played really well. You know, um, you know he, he understands the game. You know, he doesn't play outside of himself. So he's letting the game come to him, making plays, making reads uh, on what the defense is giving him. You know, the more he gets back on the court, the more feel he's going to be, the more aggressive he's going to be in making plays, looking for a shot, and getting guys open. But I thought he played really well. You guys are 10-1 and one at home. What is it about here so far that's, that's been working? Protecting home court. Um, I think guys are uh, very comfortable here, um, you know, and, and we're locked in. Um, you know, we, we always talk about coming out and not letting nobody uh, get one on us uh, at home. So um, we're just really focused and um, uh, trying to win as many games uh, at home, you know, to get that home court advantage later on. Boston lost tonight as well. You guys are only one game there, out in a sense in terms of the loss column. They got seven losses, you got eight. You guys start looking at that going as well as we're playing. I mean, it's early, but you guys are right in the thick of it. Um, honestly, uh, you know, we know that we're a top team in the East. Um, we're not. Uh, looking at game by game, like, oh, uh, we can slide in here, there. You know, it's about taking care of what we need to do. Um, not, not really focus on like what their team's doing until we face them. But um, uh, we're just focused on getting as many wins as we can and, and focusing on the little things to make us uh, a championship team, a competitive team later on in the playoffs.